Boxing blah 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 Where we blah 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 About everything boxing What's good y'all it's your boy Juice Guy checking in And yo it's getting serious at 135 man It's getting real serious My boy Tank is charged up He going off in the podcast talking about Devin and Shakur done been in the ring with him and they know what kind of power he working with and whatnot. Shakur and Dev coming back with their own responses. They ain't going for it. So all this means is we're going to get a, some, well, hopefully it means we're going to get some big fights out of all this. Um, they keep talking about the sparring that happened between Tank and Shakur and Tank and Devin, but you know, that's sparring. Like e- even no matter who, who did better, whatever, that was however many years ago. They all done got better since then. They all done learned stuff. They all learned about each other. So it'll definitely make for some interesting matchups. Tank got the power. Dev and Shakur, they're, they're the technicians in the ring. So it'll be real interesting to see how it all plays out. And if we actually end up getting fights out of all, out of the three of them. And how, how soon, hopefully it's not too late, you know. Um, Tank got two fights lined up, Hector Garcia and Ryan Garcia. So hopefully, maybe winter next year, into next year, we could get Shakur and Tank or something like that. But, you know, until the two fighters are actually in the ring, nothing is guaranteed. And um, like Shakur was saying, Tank already has two fights lined up. So, uh, you know, everybody wants to talk when they got stuff on deck and uh use it to promote their their current situation but will we see tank and shakur will we see tank and devin haney i'm not sure but as a fan of boxing i'm definitely interested in it and uh my my other question is where are the other guys at 135 like okay these three are great but shouldn't some more people be chirping and chiming in talking about what they can do also uh so it would be great if we could get some some other hats in the ring too trying to get in the mix um, but yeah, man, as a fan of boxing, I'm real excited about what's going on and, uh, would love to see, would love to see, um, Tank, Shakur, uh, Devin Haney versus Tank, Shakur versus Devin Haney. And, uh, yeah, man, hopefully we get some great fights out of all this. Boy, look, we got Tank Davis talking trash. He talking trash about the sparring matches with, uh, Devin Haney and Shakur Stevenson. They over here like, uh, what the hell are you talking about, boy? You know what time it was. Devin Haney said, uh, well, Bill Haney said he wants some money because uh, Tank quit in the doghouse style sparring that they do. Uh, so he like, I don't know what Tank talking about, but Tank said we sparred twice and I almost cracked him. I almost knocked him out, all that good stuff. So I was like, ooh, ooh, ooh. When we start talking about sparring like that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, who, who be snitching on sparring? But uh, you know what I mean? I guess the new folks doing it like that these days. Um, but out of all of them, who you think comes out on top? Uh, ew, it's hard to say, man. All of them got these skill sets. I mean, Devin the tallest, the biggest, uh, and, and works that jab and defense like no other. Uh, Shakur just coming up, but he might have the overall best skill set. Uh, then we got Tank, I mean, counter punching, power punch extraordinaire, get you out of there extraordinaire. Uh, I mean, with all three of those, who you think gonna win? I mean, and, okay, that's given that Tank gets by Ryan Garcia, cause we got the Tank versus Ryan Garcia fight coming up. Uh, so I just really wanna know what's going on. What's on y'all minds, man? Uh, I personally think, ugh, I love Tank, I love you Tank. I think it's gonna come down between Devin Haney and Shakira Stevenson. Because I don't think 
any of them will knock out any of them. I think all three of them box with superior skill sets. And I don't see any of them being able to just really knock out those ones. Unless it's like a quick counter slip. Like, and Tank has a, the best ability to do a quick counter slip or slip counter knockout. Uh, you know, right there, boom, just like that. Might be losing the whole fight and then all of a sudden, slip him. And all of a sudden, Tank goes on victorious. So, uh, I mean, let me know what y'all think uh, about this whole three, three, three teams type thing with, with uh, Tank, Shakur, Devin Haney. We're going to say four. We got Ryan Garcia. He about to fight Tank now. So everybody fighting each other. So I like to see it. I like to see it. Lightweights. Let's get it. Um, so yeah, this is your boy AWMIT with Boxing Blah, 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 where we blah, blah, blah about everything boxing. Uh, we'll be at the Mayweather Boxing Fitness Center in Atlanta, Atlantic Station. Won't y'all come out here? I got to do that dance bad class. So come see me out here one of these days, all right? Also, follow me on Instagram, Almighty Athletics. It's two L's in Almighty when you see it, all right? Almighty Athletics. Uh, make sure you share, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I am signing out. It's your boy. Boy.